Hello, dear subscribers and viewers of this channel. Today, I want to discuss with you something about prayer. And I believe by God's grace, you are going to be blessed by this presentation or simple talks uh, which he uh, intends to make us come close to God. Then we are talking about prayer, the necessity of a prayer. Why do you need to pray? I do believe we have many Bible verses that we can use to talk about a prayer. And... Uh, and we have read them many times, but why our prayer life has not changed? It's because we don't get something which is very important concerned with the prayer. Some people have made the prayer to be like uh, a way for us to get our needs. Like when I need something, just I have to pray much. When I need this, I need to pray much because it, prayer is something like a user as, as a check. Uh, the more you have more money, the more you can buy. So the more I pray, the more I get a lot of things that I need. So we have lost the essence of prayer. When we start the life of Jesus Christ, we find the importance of prayer. Jesus Christ prayed, and there are many verses that we can read uh, uh, with Jesus in the issue of prayer. The book of Mark chapter 1, chapter 5, uh, verse 5 talks about Jesus Christ waking up early in prayer. Chapter 6 talks about Jesus Christ talking about, about prayer. Uh, chapter 7, uh, the book of Matthew talks about prayer, and that 6 is, is, is Matthew also. When you go to the book of Luke, it talks about the prayer. When we go to the book of John, it talks about the prayer. Many times, Jesus prayed. When you go to the book of Acts, we talk about disciples. They prayed. Why prayer? What the essence of prayer? What's something that prayer does? Jesus Christ he prayed, but he, has not, he had no money. And not pray that I need a house. I need this. But he spent more time with the prayer. In the book of Luke chapter 18, Jesus said that we have to pray. The book of Ephesians chapter 6 talks about the prayer as the support of those uh, weapons, spiritual weapons. Why do we need a prayer? Why did Jesus pray if he was God? He did not have any sin. But he prayed and he prayed a lot. Sometimes he prayed the whole night. Why do we need to pray? To pray? My friend, Prayer, I enjoy it makes it clear. Prayer is the breath of the soul. When you pray, you are breathing. You, you are, we can say that our spiritual nature, okay? Our spiritual, we have the physical nature and we have the spiritual nature. Our spiritual nature, which is from God, it does not, it is not fed by, by food, by things, okay? You eat, you, you, you drink. The spiritual nature does not get that. But the spiritual nature survives by the... But the spiritual nature survives by the, by the breath of life which comes from God. That's why we need to have more prayers in our life. You may say, so why, why? But my friend, I say, why is because uh, the, the, uh, the survival of Adam and Eve, even before sin, was by eating the tree of life and communicating to God. When you don't communicate to God, you are dead. Though you might be living like the devil, he is dead though he's living because he knows one day he's going to stop because he separated himself from God. And so with us, when we want to survive we need to have more prayer. Why? Because when you pray, we strengthen our spiritual nature. We have the spiritual nature and the carnal nature. I can say like that. The spiritual nature goes directly to God. And the, spirit, and the physical nature, our carnal nature, goes to sin. I can say spirit, the, 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 the sinful nature goes to the, against God. So when we pray, no matter what we are praying about, Jesus Christ gives us strength in our spiritual nature. We can endure the challenges that are ahead of us. We have fallen into sins many times because we don't have spiritual power to withstand those temptations. When they come to us, we find ourselves weak. For example, you can hear the news like uh, somebody wants to fight with somebody. This kickboxing, okay, kickboxing. They want to fight. Maybe Mike Tyson and somebody now. That's what's Logan Paul, something like that one. 
I, 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 I saw that post on YouTube. Like Logan Paul is going to fight with Mike Tyson or Mike Tyson with somebody. Somebody I don't want to say I'm exactly right about this because I, I don't know exactly how it is. But at least I can relate that. This person is gone, Logan Paul, because he knows. I'm using this as an example, okay? Because Logan Paul knows that the devil, that, that Mike Tyson is a legend uh, in fighting, okay, in the boxing arena or in boxing room, whatever it is. He's a legend. He knows many tricks, though he has just like retired, but still, he knows how to fight. This young man, because you know that person is very tricky. He is going to prepare to the uttermost because he knows if I don't prepare enough, when I get that person, he will give me a K or knockout. But if he doesn't, maybe he keeps eating and uh, drinking and sleeping, no more, no practices, no exercises, no what, no listening to those people what teaching and fighting. When he faces the uh, the opponent. What will happen is he will just, just a, a second, it will take a second, he will be down. But if he makes a, at least a practice and exercises and listening and tries the best, he may take maybe one second round, third round. But if, if he tries the best, the best to the highest, then he will win. I don't want you to focus on that, the issue of boxing. What I'm trying to depict here is this one. We need to to survive, okay? We are living in the world where we are ourselves, we are enemies of ourselves, okay? We don't need to live to face like, I want to fight the devil. I want to pray to fight the devil. No, we are our enemies of ourselves, okay? Myself, I am the enemy of myself because of the spiritual nature and the physical nature. So if I'm an enemy of my own, of myself, means what? I, I, I have to know what to do and that issue means I have to pray that the, the, the side which I want to win, to win. And the side which I wanted to win is the physical, is the spiritual nature. And so because I want my spiritual nature to win against the carnal nature in the matter of life here in the world, I don't want to save the, the, the carnal nature. I want to save the, phys the spiritual nature, which is from God. Then I will have to give the life more on the spiritual nature. Praying. Because when I pray, I don't pray to win the battle. I pray to feed the spiritual nature. I study the Bible to feed the spiritual nature. And then the more I come close to God, the more I get strength. Because... Uh, uh, I can say the, 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 the spiritual nature of God or the way God is, is, is life is contagious. When I come across, I become affected. When I pray, I become affected. The more I join with him, he always gives, okay? He doesn't always receive. He gives. So he will give me his nature, his spiritual power will come. The more I come close to him, the more I draw the power to, to, to myself. And so, if I don't, I, I keep feeding him the spill on the physical nature. I don't say that it's physical nature, physical things are bad. No. I have to study if I'm a student. If I'm a policeman, I have to, 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 to know how to work, how to do everything right. If I'm a politician, I have to know how to do everything right. I have to study. If I'm a doctor, I have to study. I have to work. I have to, if I'm a businessman, I have to struggle to find how can I make my business go higher. Don't say because I'm a businessman, so I, will, I will only pray, 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 and then my business will go up. No. That, those are physical things. The, the spiritual part on the business, but that is the physical part. That's what I need to study and to invest and to search and to do whatever I can to make sure that the physical, the, the physical world, I go up in a physical world. But if I do that alone and I don't invest in the spiritual nature, the battle which will come in the spiritual nature f using the physical will tackle me. Okay, if a person insults me, he insults me by using the mouth, not the physical. But his 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 goal is to attack my spiritual nature. So if it comes the physical, the physical will react to me. The carnal nature will react. 
to, to, to insult back, to, to fight back. But because it has come the phys- to the physical, but the spiritual nature has more power than the carnal nature. What will happen? The carnal nature will react first before the physical. And the carnal nature will say, I bless you. Have mercy. I forgive you. And so, the physical will not react. Then, I will be a winner because I've used the spiritual to fight the spiritual battle, though the spiritual battle has come through the physical one. Okay, do you get me? So we have to invest more on the, on the, on the, the spiritual nature. But even the businesses, you are doing the business. My friend, if you're doing it in a, in, a, in, a, in a physical way, you won't go far if you're a son and daughter of God. Because the battle will come and the battle is very serious. And so you have to invest also in a prayer. Pray that the Holy Spirit will give you strength to withstand all challenges that come so that you can go up where you want to go for the glory of God. So when you, 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 you neglect a prayer, my friend, you are putting yourself in the trouble. You are destroying yourself. You are making the war that goes within your heart. To, uh, your, your heart means your carnal nature and spiritual nature. You are going to make what you hate to win. But when you keep submitting yourself to God, you make what you love to win. But if you are not born again, it doesn't work. You need to be saved first. I do believe this one has help, uh, will help us to value prayers, to talk to God, to spend time with God in prayer, talking to him. That, it doesn't mean that every time when you go, go and ask things, you can ask it to know him. You can ask it to love him. You can ask it to be filled by the Holy Spirit. Seek the relationship. Best relationship with God pays than Buying things using faith and buying things using prayer. My friend, we need God. May God bless you as you spend the time with God in Jesus' name. Amen.